Hi guys, this is my skiing trip essentials for beauty and skincare, which I must say skincare is mega important because I found the winter air going out from the slopes and then coming into the hot air at the hotel really takes a toll on your skin. So I've got a few items I'd like to recommend that I'm using on this holiday, which have been invaluable. So I've been cleansing my skin with the normal um, Emma Hardy cleansing meringue balm and I also brought a small pot of the Eve cleansing balm so then after that I have been putting on at night the Estee Lauder advanced night repair which I love and then on top of that I've been using this oil because I have found it's the super facialist by Una Brennan rose hydrate miracle makeover facial oil now this stuff is excellent because I found my skin's been getting quite dry while I've been skiing because it's been minus 10 a lot of days and it needs rehydrating so this has been fantastic now for the children I've been using this cream by Ren and it's the emollient rescue cream and that's been fantastic because sometimes they've got very dry around their nose where maybe their nose has been running and I've been blowing their nose all the time and this cream has really brought it back and I've used this as well finally another cream I brought with me is the I never say this right it's the Dr Hauschka <laughs> Hauschka don't know how you say it the um, rose day cream and this one isn't the light one it's the heavy one and I've been using this on the children and on myself so all of these creams have been helping me keep hydrated and then on top of that I have been using for my makeup each day because I have been wearing makeup I know some people might say what are you wearing makeup skiing for well I like to I think I look better so I've been using the Aborea BB cream which is fantastic I can't recommend this stuff enough it's from Phil Unique I use between the color Dor and Claire I mix the two together and what's really good about this stuff is it's got an SPF 20 25. It's supposed to be light coverage, but it's got really good coverage. It really covers up, even though it's a cream and it's got the SPF in it. So I can recommend that. The other cream I've been using underneath some days is the Dermalogica 50 Factor Solar Defense Cream, and that's been really good. So after I've put my, I don't know, BB cream foundation on, what will I go with next? Urban Decay Primer Potion, and I put that on my eyelids. I love this stuff. Tried the others, but I like this best. And then, of course, you can can't go skiing without a bit of a Christian Dior eye palette so just a sweep of uh, that and I don't use a pencil I just use the darker color just to do my um, in the lash line and then a light color swept over I've got my eyelash curlers yes I take those on holiday and my favorite mascara which is my L'Oreal So Couture. Oh, the family's coming back now. I can hear them coming in. They're gonna wait. So that mascara, fantastic. And then for your lips, lips are mega important on a skiing holiday. You got to keep them moisturized. I have quite a lot of stuff here. I'll go with the kids' favorite choice first. The kids like, whoop, I've dropped it, is the Burt's Bees. And I think this one's in pomegranate. So they've been using that a lot. Um, so I brought about three of these and I popped them in the pocket of their ski jackets. So they're fantastic. I bought another lip balm from Trespass and that's got a 30 SPF on it. And that's got a clip on it, but they haven't been using that quite so much. The Burt's Bees seem to have won with the children, but I popped those in as well. You can never have enough. And then mummy's favorite is the famous, sorry, it's got a bit of mess over it is the Elizabeth Arden 8 Hour Cream. I love this stuff and uh, it's bionic. So I've been using this on my lips at night, in the morning, in the middle of the day on top of a lipstick. And the lipsticks I've brought that work and stay on and don't go anywhere are of course my favorite um, YSL. Um, I've got number 11 and the limited edition in number 33. 33 is like a berry color and number 11 is what I've got on now. It's like a fuchsia, ooh, a fuchsia pink. And that's fantastic. And if it, if it feels like it gets a tiny bit dry, I just pop on a bit of the eight hour lip balm on top. And then if you want to go more cash and you don't want to wear a lipstick, I've been finding the ones that really last the pace is the Laura Mercier lip glosses. Fantastic, because when they sort of wear down, they don't leave gunk or lines or anything. They just 
just go beautifully into your lips and then I just pop on a fresh coat and you don't have to keep within the lines so to speak you just whack it on so you can look pretty when you're skiing for blush I've been using a cream blush while I've been skiing and I've been using the matte cream blush and the one I've been using I think it might be discontinued is Brit Wit and I really like the color of that so I've just been popping that on and I find that lasts the pace while I've been skiing for hands because hands you know get pretty dry I've used loads of stuff for hands so I've used the Burt's Bees um, cuticle one for my nails and I brought with me on holiday one nail polish because we came just with cabin bags it's an Estee Lauder one I think it's Esther Lauder I always say Lauder Lauder in Blackberry so if I get chips I just paint over I'm not fussy cow shed hand lotion I've got a fantastic one from New Zealand um, the Great Barrier Island Bee Company do one Manuka honey which I love and my friend sends me from her shop Powernesia in Auckland. This stuff is brilliant. I have one in the car, one in my handbag and one at home. Finally, if you need that extra in the evenings, I've got the Dermalogica Skin Hydrating Mask and I've loved this. You leave it on for about 10-15 minutes and I have to say while I've been here, it's nearly all completely disappeared on my face. There's not been much to rinse off. So that's been really excellent. For my son and daughter, moisturiser they've been using and this is one Carolyn Hirons recommended. I think my son Oscar is skiing across the room over there, pushing his ski socks everywhere. Be quiet Oscar. Is the San Pharma moisturizer so that's unisex and my daughter's been using that as well as my son just so their cheeks don't get really red like with windburn it hasn't got any SPF in it but they pop on the Dermalogica solar defense as well if I can get hold of them fast enough before they run away saying I don't want anything mummy you know how it is but that's what I bring skiing and I would say concentrate on your skin because going from minus 10 outside on a windswept chairlift to coming inside to the hotel where it's lovely and tranquil but quite hot sometimes you really need to keep your skin hydrated i hope that helps that's what i've been doing and that came with me in my toiletry bag in my cabin bag and it has kept me sorted on this trip thanks for watching bye